Well, we've got another beautiful day in store, very mild temperatures and the sunshine, still a lot of it, but it is being dimmed uh, by some high clouds out there. So not completely sunny, but it's still a beautiful day either way you slice it. All right, let's take a live look outside overlooking downtown Norfolk over the water here. And again, you can see the sun poking out there and the clouds, believe it or not, will continue to increase into the overnight hours. But for the bulk of the daylight hours, we're still looking pretty good. Temperatures are well into the 50s in many spots, 59 in Gloucester, where 53 in Exmoor. Good afternoon if you're joining us from Melfa right at 53 degrees. On the peninsula already into the 60s in Williamsburg at 63, 59 in Newport News. Downtown Newport News you're checking in right at 50 degrees. Upper 50s at the airport in Norfolk, also Craddock at 58, 60 in Longview right now. And then into northeastern North Carolina we've got a bunch of 60s on the map from Elizabeth City at 62 to Belvedere also at 62, still holding in the 50s closer to the water along the Outer Banks. Checking in at 54 and duck out along the pier. Now the winds, it's a little bit breezy in some spots, but still fairly light for most of us. But the winds continue out of the south and west. That is a very warm wind for us. So temperatures are going to continue to climb above normal. We're talking 10 to even 15 degrees above where we should be for this time of the year. On satellite and radar, you can see the high clouds moving over the area, not rain producing clouds. We're going to stay nice and dry, at least for the time being. But our next cold front is already well off to our north and west and some showers starting to ride into the deep south. That rain will move our way as we head into Wednesday afternoon. So let's show you on Futurecast here again right now. We're mainly in the 50s and 60s as we go through the afternoon. We'll top out in the low to middle 60s. So again above where we should be for this time of the year, which is in the low 50s. If you do have any last minute shopping to do, don't forget we're less than a week away from Christmas. If you're going maybe around six, seven o'clock clock will drop back into the 50s. And then overnight tonight, those clouds will start to spill in. We'll see increasing clouds as that cold front gets closer to us. So we'll kick off your Wednesday morning very mild with the clouds in place and the 40s closer to 50 at the coast. And then by Wednesday afternoon, our rain chances will go up. So here we are just after lunchtime, mainly into North Carolina in the 50s. And then by Wednesday afternoon, notice we drop back into the 40s and the rain becomes a little bit more widespread. And then everything will clear out of here by Thursday. So for today, 65 degrees, dim sunshine is what we'll call it. 48 with increasing clouds tonight. And then here's a look at the seven day forecast. 55 on Wednesday, upper 40s for the first day of winter. And then it looks like Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. You may need to keep the umbrella handy and maybe the rain boots as well. It's going to be a little bit on the wet side. Oh man. But we still have some time to adjust the forecast if need okay. be. Hopefully. Well, Santa can always find his way. So it's oh fun. yeah. He can always put on a rain jacket or whatever. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks, Aisha. Uh -huh.